Hey, how's it going guys? Wonderful here, and today I'm going to be showing you all of the newest Please Donate scripts. And these scripts have been updated to get you the most Robux possible, so if you're looking for them, all the links are in the description. Okay, coming over here to this green script, it has an auto goal farm, which is definitely the most efficient way of making Robux. It's going to put a goal that's 5 Robux above what your current goal is automatically. And I did this on my main account and I only ran it for like 20 minutes and I already got 100 Robux. So you could probably get even more if you left it on overnight. And here's how it works. So you come over here to the booth tab and you can pick a color if you want to. I'd recommend you just type this in FF3131, which is the code for red. Because of course red pops out to your eyes more. And then you click this right here. You can set your goal sign. So I'm going to make it say my goal for this year. I'm going to click save. And then let's click uh, dance and text update. So you just dance by your sign. It's going to say my goal for this year, 40 out of 45. And then let's say someone donates, it's going to go up again. And it's going to say 45 out of 50. And it's just going to keep going up over and over and over again. And if your game lags after you run this for a while, you can set the FPS limit a little lower. Or you can disable rendering completely and just make the whole screen white so that you're not going to lag at all. But yeah, that's how it works. This is definitely... I know it doesn't sound like much, but it's the easiest way of getting Robux. And if you want to make it even better, you can combine it with some of these other scripts. So for example, the dancing one, you could do stuff like this. Let's do the Old Town Road Dance. Play selected emo. And this is FE by the way, so everyone in the whole game can see this. And you can even do like an animation. So let's do something like, well actually those are kind of bad. Let's just do dances. Let's do something like Take Me Under. Let's do um, emote speed a little higher. Just do something crazy. So yeah, this is just going to get people's attention. Of course, you could make this color whatever you want. You could make the goal increase by whatever you want. Like, for example, I could do 10. So now I'm going to do 10. And then the goal increased will be 10. And let's check this right here. Text update. And now it's going to say 40 out of 50. So that's how it works. As you can see, pretty self-explanatory, really easy to do. And this is definitely, again, the best way of doing it. But if you want to do another way, you can also do the auto thanks. And if you have the sign game pass, which is this right here, let me turn off this emote and stop it. Okay, there we go. Go to the sign tab. You could do this right here and make it say something. So we could do like, I'm just going to do hello, save it, put the color there, and then let's do text update. And let's see what this looks like now. Text update. Hopefully this works. Save. Okay, so it did make it say hello. I don't know why it didn't say uh, this color right there. Well, either way, the sign is definite. Oh, there it is. So now it's going to be red. So if you want to get people's attention, you can go like this, say hello, guide them over to your sign. But yeah, overall, the easiest way is going to be doing this thing. Because I mean, if I was you, I would definitely donate to someone who has a goal set up because that's what they want. Um, the chat settings, this is definitely the most effective one. So this right here is going to be your thank you messages and your begging messages. So thank you messages is definitely very efficient because if you thank them, they might do it again. There we go. Whoever saw that, they just donated to me. I got 10 Robux. And if I do text update, I don't know why I turned it off. Now it says 50 out of 60. And if you have this thank you thing set up, I don't know why I didn't do that. That right there. You can also have this as any message you want. So I can say like, thanks so much. Save. On the begging messages, these are all of the begging things. So like, save this. Change the begging delay to seconds. I'm going to do like... Let's do 10 seconds. I know, okay, 15 seconds. This is actually crazy. You should never do this because whenever people see you spamming begging things in the chat, they're going to think you're just using a script or something. And that now this guy feels kind of scammed because he donated me to finish my goal and I just moved it up. So yeah, this is how you do it. Basically, this is how it works. And this right here is the um, donation messages. So I don't know why it's not sending it. Oh, I forgot to do the begging. There we go. Please donate. Auto thank you. So yeah, really, really simple stuff. If you want to have that open, it's pretty cool. The webhook is going to send you messages whenever someone sent, um, whenever someone donates on your Discord server. So really cool stuff there. Of course, server hopping is actually really necessary. If you put this in your auto execute folder on your exploit, whether that's like Synapse X or Vega X or just anything you're using, and then you click this, it's going to automatically server hop after 30 minutes all the way up to three hours or two hours. So I could set it to like 30 minutes and then after 30 minutes, it's going to hop to a new server. So overall, extremely efficient. I mean, you guys saw it here first I left it running for like one minute and got 10 Robux. So yeah, really, really nice stuff. This is only on this script. I also have these three other scripts and there's even going to be a fourth one in the description. I'm pretty sure 
but this is the emotes, that's all that GUI is. This one right here is going to be the auto thanks, so if you click this, if someone donates to you, it's going to thank them. And then this is the auto beg, which is going to be after 30 seconds. Let's make it do every one second. It's just going to donate every, it's going to ask every one second. And there's no way to change this, I don't think. Yeah, there's no way to change it. You could spawn a fake nuke if you want to, which is also going to be on this script. You can actually customize it on that script. So there's the nuke going off. It's going to go up in the air and boom, crash into the floor. It says that the, this is the creators of the script donated me 1 billion Robux. Of course they actually didn't, but that's just a fake thing. So if you want to troll your friends like screen share and say like, oh, I just got so much Robux, click this right here, uh, slide this up to however many Robux you want. And you can either donate to someone else, like say like, I'll donate to my other account, click this, click enter, uh, select the player, and then let's do donate. And I'm pretty sure it's going to spawn like a ban hammer or something. I don't really know how this one works. But yeah, you can also donate to yourself. So if you click this, donate for you, it's going to spew all these Robux out of the top. I think this big ban hammer spawns. Let's, I'm going to zoom out so you can see it. There it is. Maybe you guys saw this at the beginning of the video. It looks really, really nice. Someone's talking to me over here. Please donate. Um, but yeah, really cool stuff. It's going to put the ban hammer in the air, slash down on the floor. If you've never, if you guys have never seen this before, it's pretty cool. And three, two, one, and boom. There we go, 94 million Robux. So the most you can do is 1 billion. And yeah, so really cool script over here. Um, You have fake headless as well. I don't know if this is FE. I mean, I'm guessing it's not FE because that's pretty cool if it is, but there it is. That's the fake headless if you want to see it. This is going to be uh, jump power. You could do walk speed. Just jump around the map really high. Go like this, you could do your gravity pretty low. Just go whoosh, just go through the air. Yeah, anyways, really nice scripts. This is the only scripts that I'm going to be showcasing for this video, but there's of course tons of other ones. The reason I'm showing you guys these scripts only is because this one is the best for getting Robux. If you pair it up with the dances, it's even better. And if you're trying to troll your friends, you could use this one. So all the scripts have a different purpose. And then the reason you might want to use this one is just because it's kind of convenient. You have the begging cooldown. The credits to Froji and Hase or Hache for developing. Uh, server Hopper, you could teleport. This is the teleport cooldown. You could do, I don't even know how many hours that is. But yeah, so overall really nice scripts. Let's leave this on for a couple more seconds and see what happens. Let's go over here. And if you're not near your sign, by the way, if you're not like standing right by it, it's definitely not going to work as well. So let's try this right here. Auto beg. Let's change this to every, uh, let's just do every minute. So every 60 seconds, auto thank you, save. I'm just going to show you guys, these are the best settings for getting Robux. You can set up a Discord URL uh, webhook if you want to. But yeah, so here it is. This guy's checking out my sign. Let's see if he does anything. And if you want to make it a little bit better, let's just do this five. Definitely a lot easier for people because I mean, five is a lot less than 10. You can change this sign again. Uh, the FPS limit, disable rendering, I'll keep that the same. And yeah, so that's all of the settings that I'd recommend. The text update delay does not really matter, that's just going to be how fast it updates. So if you want to do it like instant, or if you want to wait. And the reason you might want to wait is because if they just donated, then they might like just be standing here, and if it instantly changes again like it did with that other guy, they might just feel like they got scammed or something. So if you want to make them not feel like they got scammed, you change this up a little bit, maybe like 30 seconds. So then if I can explain this, they donate, and then it waits 30 seconds, and then it changes it to the next goal. And yeah, so I'm pretty sure if you leave this on overnight, you could definitely make like at least a thousand Robux. Of course, it's all based on how generous people are, but if you want to make it even better, I think I'll also try to leave a uh, script in the description that teleports you into rich people's servers. Which of course you can guess is definitely a better way of making Robux, because if I look over here in the leaderboard, this guy down here with zero donated is a lot less likely to donate than this guy who donated 20k. Let's see if the guy who donated me to here is, uh, I think the guy left. Oh no, this guy donated me. So yeah, this guy does not even have that much donated, but he still donated to me. So it doesn't work all the time, but when it does, it's pretty cool. So yeah, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you can, and as always, peace.